Well, it is great to be here in Italy. We've had such a strong partnership over our 50-year history as uh, we celebrate this week. Um, the future, though, is what it's all about. We look to the future together to explore and continue on the International Space Station. This investment that we have made uh, has allowed us to gain a foothold to the universe. We truly believe that as we invest in technologies that will allow our nations to innovate and develop those kinds of activities that will bring in even more uh, economic benefits to our country. So we intend to continue to lead technology uh, through our investments in space so that we can uh, explore the unknown and have a brighter future for all of us. Well, my master's degree is in science, technology, and public policy, so it's great to be with students here in Italy studying similar types of activities. I would say to students everywhere that space activities are going to allow us to have a brighter future in any area that they want to study. Certainly studying science, technology, math, and engineering, the STEM fields, are something that we all believe can help us to have these future economies and future discoveries uh, that will benefit all. But I truly believe that education is the key. Stay in school, study things that you truly believe in, that you believe that you can spend your time in, and that you find meaningful. Space to me as an investment allows us to leave behind a world better than we found it. And that I think is a goal uh, for us all. The U.S. and Italy have had nearly 200 agreements during our space history this last 50 years. We actively have uh, 20 agreements today. We are working to put together a framework agreement so that the two countries can more quickly begin activities uh, and for specific missions. We cooperate in human space flight on the International Space Station as well in, as space science and earth science.